Hello, so in this video I just want to show you how you can use your Sony Xperia S as essentially a mobile office. Now we know smartphones are designed to do lots and lots, um, but there are times when you're away from a desk or you're away on business for example and you want to carry out some work, do some emails, write some documents, fill out some Excel spreadsheets, but doing it on the phone just really isn't that comfortable. So you might be in your hotel room and many hotel rooms nowadays have HD displays. So for this example, we've connected the Sony Xperia S to an HD display. But what we've got, if you look down in the bottom left hand corner here, we've got the Xperia S connected to a live dock. And on the Sony live dock, there's a USB port. Now you can connect different peripherals into that. But what we've actually done is rather than connecting one, we've connected um, an additional four USB ports through a USB uh, hub or extender and we've got connected a mass storage drive and a wireless keyboard and mouse. So here's the keyboard we've got connected to it, here's the mouse and these are things that you might need to connect to your device if you're to work uh, mobile. You know you, you need your mass storage device that's got documents on it so we're at the home screen here, we can navigate through using the cursor keys on the actual keyboard or I can do it using the mouse. And up here in the top we can go down to our notifications. Because we're connected via HDMI you can change some of the settings to best suit you. So you might be um, using different screen sizes. So you might want to change the resolution. You may actually want to change the output size. So we're at 95% here. But we can reduce the amount of actual size of the screen it takes up when connected. And we can control that by the mouse and by the cursor keys from here. We can press home on the keyboard and it'll take us back to the home screen. So you can see that I've got USB storage connected. So if I click into that, I've got a four gig drive connected here so I can unmount it, I can erase it. And you know, it gives us lots of options. It's showing there the total storage space on the actual device itself. I can come out of that. So I could make calls from the device here by searching my contacts or actually typing in a number and it bringing up my contacts. I'm keying that in from the keypad or I can type it in using the mouse if I choose. I can send a message. So here's one I started earlier. So I've just clicked into the message here. And now I'm writing on screen using a keyboard. I can go into my applications. So be it music or gallery. So let's go into the music player. So I could play some music whilst I do some work. But if I just want to get on with my work, I can go into my email application just like you would with a text message and use the keyboard and what have you to do things. You can add shortcuts here to your desktop. You can view your calendar. And it can be a little bit tricky and get getting used to using your mouse doing things. It's not quite so natural, but you've got your office suite here. Now, haven't registered up to this one, but the same principle applies, you can bring up your, your documents and um, you can 
edit them as you choose. So that's just a very quick demonstration of how you can use your Sony Xperia S for business um, or just to make life simpler if you don't have access to a desktop PC or laptop or you're at home and you, you want to do a few things but you can use your Sony Xperia S to power everything.